Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Krishna. Today I'm going to show you how to create a simple MS Word form. Alright, I have just created a sample form uh, just for this video purpose. Uh, but actually it might not look like this. This is very simple and I have uh, made it simple enough to you know, show how to create it okay and this is the final output and i will show you what exactly it looks all right then i will show you how i did it okay uh, basically it's a subcontract farm and uh, you have to fill a few some fields all right and uh, the big thing here is uh, i will not uh, be able to edit this grayed out or differently colored uh, fields all right only these fields which are marked in the white color or uh, without any color are editable uh, okay as you see here okay i can't even select anything here only thing i can select his uh these white fields okay let's start filling this form and see okay uh x y z come funny okay and other good thing here is if i press tab it will go to the next editable field okay that's one good thing all right some xyz name okay okay and one bad thing here is uh, you cannot go to the next line unless it's completely filled I have tried uh, with shift enter or uh, alt enter control enter nothing nothing works okay it has to complete the entire line then only it will go to the second line okay that's a really bad thing I will have to see how I can do that okay it's nicely going to the next next uh, next fields okay this okay obviously you don't have to enter here after taking the printout maybe have to sign all right so this is a simple form in ms word all right let's see how i did it how you can do it all right it's very simple okay i will just create a new empty file or empty ms word document let's create and i will insert few rows i mean table with few rows and columns okay uh, two rows and three columns right, let's expand it all right this is enough enough to you know see how i did it i'll first gray out this uh, differently colored this shading select the color you want I'm gonna select this okay okay that's good and I will type something here type something here name address contract details details okay okay now the thing is I have to insert few controls into the uh, columns so that I can edit those. So how do I do that? Under developers, we have something like plain controls and uh, rich controls. So I'm gonna select plain control. Okay, place the cursor here and uh, say one plain control. I have to do for each the each of the field okay so now i have inserted a control here so that i can put some text here all right next thing is controlling what can be edited or what should be edited so that is very simple again you have to restrict this content from editing so under again developers tab you have something here restrict editing click that and you have few things three options uh, uh, we are interested in editing restrictions restricting the fields or uh, columns or tables which can be edited 
all right Let's click that okay if you click we have few options here track changes we don't want that and comments no okay this is the one we are interested in filling the forms since i have created a form using uh, controls all right and i have to select this filling in forms so if i select this i will be able to fill only on the fields which are form form fields okay basically it's a form field and i can only fill those forms apart from that i cannot do anything i can't even delete change or insert so to be to enable this you need to start yes start enforcing the protection okay optionally you can give password right now i'm not going to give anything i'll just say okay right your form is now restricted from editing the fields which are not editable okay so you can't even select anything here only you can type these things here and then press tab enter something press tab enter something if i press again tab it will go to no it didn't okay uh, the tab will stop at the la last uh, field okay friends this is some have created a simple form using ms word and one thing you should not should be noted here is the developer tab by default it's not enable i mean it's not available in the ribbon for that you have to go to file file then options okay and then uh, custom ribbon on the right hand side you have something like i mean the main tabs here you need to select this developer tab and then press ok i have already selected so i can see the the ribbon uh, developers tab in the ribbon all right so friends this is how i created this simple form if you liked it please press like check out other useful videos on my channel mostly on ms word automation thanks again